I've created a bit of a leaning tower of Pisa here selling fast well hello you wonderful people and welcome back to my office um, it is a picking orders day we've got a bunch to go out how many orders are we on uh, 52 orders to find somewhere in this chaos um, if you saw recently my my last video I talked about listing lots of media this stuff and this stuff so because I've been listing loads of media loads of media has been selling and one order in particular kind of blew my mind so we're gonna start there with an order of CDs and then we'll carry on and pick the rest. So if that sounds in oh jeez. If that sounds interesting, stick around and we'll find everything that I need to pick and package and send out to its new owners today. So here is the order I am talking about. This is awesome. So I listed loads of CD singles in little bundles and one buyer who's actually in South America, bought six of the bundles. Let me quickly show you the sort of thing. So there's four Depeche Mode CD singles there from Violator, really nice bundle. I think that was 30 pounds or thereabouts. Another small bundle of Depeche Mode stuff, some Erasure stuff. Whoever this buyer is has exactly the same taste as me. <laughs> um, really nice lot of Dave Garn. CD singles, all of those. I think they were 25, something like that. Loads of Pet Shop Boys stuff. There's two different lots here, um, including this really nice. I wouldn't normally do this kind of thing, double CD single pack with the little bobbly sleeve. Very nice. Lots of other cool stuff in here. So anyway, all of that was purchased by the same buyer, six separate lots. And the price came to 107 pounds 94 pence for that little pile of CD singles. Isn't that amazing? And because they're in South America, um, I'm doing GSP for my international shipping these days across the board. Um, very rarely do we do our own international shipping now. And I looked into it and they paid another £32 to cover uh, eBay's global shipping program cost. So they paid nearly £140 total, which is mind blowing. But yeah, what a great way to start a picking orders video. Easily my favourite order of the day, that one. Right, so let's crack on and whiz through the rest of it. If I scroll to the bottom, we need to find, oh yes, finally sold this, um, Playmobil Dinosaurs. This really surprised me because in the past, dinosaur Playmobil stuff has just flown out for me. This, for whatever reason, took its merry time. Uh, went on offer in the end um, at £13, um, which was a fair bit below what it started at maybe I went too high. So a little baseboard and two dinosaur figures. And I'm glad that is finally leaving the building. And then there is loads of media in this. So we will whiz through as quickly as we can. We sold Cinderella Story and another Cinderella Story as one lot. Zumba Fitness on the Wii. Modified Streetcar Events DVD. Um, Talk, talk. Oh, I'm not going to struggle to remember all this. Right, I think I'm going to write down a load and then we'll take the list and do it that way. Bear with. Okay, we'll start with that lot. So I don't have to attempt to remember it all and fail. So, Cinderella. Now, because this is so packed, this might be a little bit tricky because some of it's going to be behind. But these first two are right here. Two Cinderella Story DVDs. Zumba on the Wii. Oh, I've, I've made a mess and put stuff in the way. Um, 
Zumba on the way done. Now that car, it's like a street car racing DVD. Can't see it there. I think it might, ah, oh, it's right down here. That one. Then we need Talk Talk CD. Let's move these. I was listing these yesterday. These are little airfix kits. Um, so, what did I say? Talk Talk CD. Uh, no, that's not it. That's... And yes, if you are screaming at the screen, you need a system for filing. I know. I know, and I have done in the past. Oh, there's Paul Willer. We need Paul Willer and Banana Rama. Those are on the list. I can't see. There it is. Talk, talk. Oh, hello. Anyone for tea? Yes, please. No sugar. What, there you go. what have you sold? No, no tea, no sugar. <laughs> what have you sold? Uh, Kath Kidston tea set. And how much did we get on these? £20, I think. Took an offer. Oh, some lovely breakables for me to package. Aren't you so kind? Okay, bye now. Bye. Anyway, we found the Talk Talk. That's that one. Along with Banana Rama and Paul Weller. I think there's a couple of uh, shout outs I need to give on some of these orders. We'll do that in a minute. The Office times three DVDs. So series one, series two, and the Christmas specials. Christmas specials is up there. Uh, done. Then we need both seasons. Here we go. Done. Two separate lots gone to the same buyer. Uh, George Michael CD single. So this is George Michael and Queen. They did uh, like an EP uh, with Lisa Stansfield as well. So just looking at my list, we've already found the Banana Rama and the Paul Weller. So it's just The Cure. The Cure's Head on the Door CD. Um, which is this one. So that's the first little batch. Let's do this one handed. And we will give a shout out to a couple of viewers that I think purchased some of this. Let's see if we can find a message. Yes, the Talk Talk CD says, uh, there's a message, love the YouTube videos, Nick. Hopefully I'll see this in a packing video. Cheers, Stu. Well, you've seen it get picked. I'm not going to be packing all of this on video. Um, I just won't have time. <laughs> but yes, great album, classic band. Thank you so much for the order. I'm sure there was another message on one of these. Yes, the Banana Rama. Couldn't resist this. Love your vids on YouTube. All the best for the new year, Wayne. So thank you, Wayne. Enjoy the music. And is that it? Yes, so I will write another little list and I'll get back to you. Right, new list. Um, there are two cubes on this list, so I'm going to do those first. So we'll grab the cubes from up here. And one of these is part of an order that's going to a viewer. So we will find the other part of the order, one cube, and then read the message. Two cubes. Right, let's go. So we need Dragon Force CD. I think it's that one. No, it's not. That's Arcade Fire. It's down here. Dragon Force Special Edition CD. Um, a couple of these. Bic Kids pens, which go with one of those cubes. Very nice. 
uh, Wizard of Oz. Now I bundled together the classic Wizard of Oz film with The Wiz, which was a, a remake. Ah, oh, here it is. Whoops, come on. The Wiz and the original. As a pair, that's gone. Oh, a big bundle of 18 books. I'm gonna need both hands for that. I'll come back for that. Right, Guns N' Roses CD is going to Ben. Hi Ben, if you're watching. There it is, enjoy it. Um, 60s, 1965. Now, if you remember, we had a great stack of these and I was going to bundle them all together. Ended up putting them on individually and the last one has now gone and they were on at 10 pounds a set, so did really well. And they came from that big stack of media that cost me about 12 pounds for everything. And we've sold, I don't know, six or seven of these at a tenner each or thereabouts. So yeah, good money in that. Um, Ray Charles and the Pixies, not together. I don't think they ever work together. <laughs> In the same order, Ray Charles, uh, definitive, really nice double album, and The Pixies. Now, where is that? The Pixies Complete B-Sides. Very nice. So I think that's it for my list. I need to come back for those uh, books. So, just quickly before we do the books, let's see what messages there were on these. Um, oh, there's a message on this cube and the other cube, I believe. Yes. So, cube and pens going to Andy. Hi, Nick. I really enjoy your YouTube videos and saw these. For my son, whose sixth birthday is soon, I'm sure he will enjoy them. Keep up the good work, Andy. So you bought a cube and these big pens. Now, I'll tell you what, because it's his birthday, we'll chuck in, I've got a bunch of pencil cases over here. A yellow banana-y one? I'll chuck that in as well. <laughs> Hopefully he can uh, put his pens in there maybe. Anyway, thank you so much for the order. We'll get that off to you today. And there was a message I saw um, on the other one. Where's it gone? Why can't I find it? There we go. Hi, Nick and Andrea. Long time subscriber and love the videos you bash out. Bash out. <laughs> Been meaning to get one of these cubes to try them. I remember the video when they got delivered. Yes, so do I. Take it easy, Steve. So Steve bought the other cube. Thank you very much. Forgot to get the books. Let me point you that way. Which lot is it? Okay. I've got to get this one out of the way because it's tucked right in the back. That's some of it. And that's the rest. I'm just going to click on the image and double check because I have a bunch of these running. And they're all very similar. 18. Right, okay. I'm in a muddle. It's not those. It's these and these. Massive lot. I'm pretty sure. I'm gonna I'm gonna go in and detail and, and check all, all the right titles are in there. Anyway, twenty nine ninety nine, so thirty pounds plus eight pounds to cover the shipping on those. All right, let's do this order before we move on. Uh, hi Nick, I noticed you were running out of these, so I thought I'd help out. Many thanks. Keep up the great content, Dan. Dan has bought a load of the pens, which are rapidly selling out, as Dan rightly pointed out. And Dan has bought one of each of the lots that are in here. 
So, one lot is these top six, and that's the last of them. One, two, three, four, five, six. So that's all of those gone. And then we have four left of this lot, and you've bought one of those. So that's blue, yellow, purple, pink, like so, black, and green. So cheers, Dan. As you can see, we are nearly cleared out now of those. Excellent, and we started with an almost full box. Um, how many was in it originally? 144 in the box originally. I reckon there was about seven or eight missing, maybe. And I've been selling them, it works out at a pound each. So we did okay, because I paid 15 pounds for the box. So that was worth picking up. Right, let's move on. I'm gonna do another list, bear with. Okay, next list, let's go. We need Lego Lot 2, which is tucked in here. It's the last of the mixed Lego kilos to go, and it's in there. Um, what did it sell for? Can't remember, I think they were on at about 16 or so. Yep, 16 pounds. Right, Adele and Elvis. So, Elvis one and an Adele 21. Just need to get that sticker off. I had a bunch of these, so I did a, a listing with four available. Um, Ed Sheeran Plus has gone 24 Stabilo Triangular Pencils. Um, now, is that these? Yes, I believe it is. Two packs of 12 of these triangular pencils. Can't really see, but they are. Triangular shaped. Uh, Duplo baseboard up there. Now, those eagle, eye, eagle eyed of you out there will notice that the box of car parts that sat here has gone. I cleared a bunch of that and was left with just this here and a few small bits which are now in here. So we are down to literally a handful of car parts now, which is amazing when you consider I nearly filled this office with it when we bought that haul. Uh, right, so that's the Duplo board done. Six Stabilo Easy Start. Now I marked these down and they started selling really well, which is the idea. Here we go, let's move these these ones. So another pack of those is going. I think there's more that we need to find. Um, lock, stock and layer cake right here in front of me. Great films. I remember lock, stock when that came out. When was that? It was like 98, 99, that sort of period. Classic. So I paired those up. They sell quick. And the drip mats. Uh, if you saw that video where I was picking out stock and listing it, listed all those um, pub drip tray things, these, and the first one to go is the Coca-Cola. So they're off to a good start. Right, put that under my arm. Is that everything? Coca-Cola, yes. Grab this lot, and that's done. Don't think there were any other messages to read, but we'll have a quick check. No, okay. I'm quite liking this uh, writer list and take it with me procedure, so I'll do another list, bear with. Okay, 
armed with a new list, we go again. So, meatloaf, the best of, sold. The other um, Farrier's file, uh, the last of all the Farrier's stuff, I thought I'd sold both that other day, but it was only one. Um, the other one has gone now, so yeah, really, really pleased with that. Did well on those um, blacksmith farrier's spits. Another Adele, so we'll grab another of these. And this one, can you see the cracks on the front? I need to just swap that case out, not a problem. Uh, Bowie times two. Now I listed, I listed this one individually. So that's best of Bowie 7479. And then when I was going through stock, I found best of Bowie 6974. So I adjusted the listing and put it up. And those those have now gone, which is cool. Um I can't re read my own right. Sting, Sting Best of is can you see? That one, very nice. It's the uh, remastered one as well. Good stuff. Um, 50 of these Papermate pens gone. What does that say? Oh, my writing is so awful. Oh, you can't see it's all bleached out. Oh, the waders, that's what it says. <laughs> So again, from the other day, I was picking out stuff that I've been avoiding and I put these waders on. I actually had a message come through with the order. These are going to somebody who watches the videos. So hopefully they will be perfect for you and you get a lot of use out of them. We did the whole backwards and forwards with offers thing, <laughs> which was fun, uh, but very happy to get those moved so quick. Uh, guess who spares? Um, I keep moving the box around, they're down here. So we'll take that and put it over there and I'll fish out the correct ones. Uh, Hathi, now we picked this up when we went away last weekend. It's a little Disney plush. We were talking about it in our live stream and that has sold. I think that's going to a viewer as well, I can't remember. Um, No, I really can't read my last <laughs> item on here. What comes after Hathi the elephant? Oh, Weight Watchers. Oh yes, that's what it says, okay. So in here, these were only put on yesterday or the day before. Four Weight Watchers books, set of four sold out the door. So now the guess who spares, I need one lot of the solid back ones. As we do two sorts of these, there are two subtly different sorts. One lot is four. Let me show you the difference. So there's two editions of the classic guess who. One has this hole in the back and one has a solid back. So we have two different listings running for the two sorts. So that's done. And let's quickly read out a few messages. Um, on the meatloaf, it says, thanks for the offer, Nick. Excuse me. Thanks for the offer, Nick and Andrea. Thank you for all the advice you give out on your videos. I've gained a lot of knowledge from yourselves. Keep up the good work. Many thanks, Beverly. Thank you so much for the message, Beverly, and for the order. And there was another one. Hi, Nick. I've been following you and Andrea for a couple of years. Find the videos really interesting and tend to lurk in the background of the Sunday live streams with occasional words of wisdom. That's wonderful. Uh, that's Lee who's picked up the 50 Papermate pens. And yes, on the uh, elephant, where did he go? Oh, I left him. 
I left loads of stuff. It's all still over there. This guy, which um, the viewers on Sunday helped us work out who he was, and he is Haffy. It says, can you give us a shout out please to my daughter Lauren when you package this? Thank you. Love watching your videos on YouTube. Well, it is a pleasure. Um, I'm not going to be packing on this video. I really won't have time, but there he is. He will be carefully packaged up and on his way to you today. And that is Sharon, so cheers. All right, sip of tea. I got so much procrastinating done today. Right, new list that hopefully I'll be able to read. We start with uh, Breakfast at Tiffany's and My Fair Lady. I bundled those together and they have sold. Here we go. Wonderful. Audrey Hepburn. Um, ah, two wrestling DVDs. Where be they? They be here. I'll just move that. Oh, that didn't really work. This one, One Night Stand. This one, The Great American Bash, 2005. Sold as a pair. Oh, the Kaiser Chiefs are sold. This is a really nice special edition set of their classic album, Employment. There's lots of cool bits and bobs in there, poster, some bank notes, um, really nice thing. And it's got a bonus disc as well, double disc set. Really pleased that went. Beautiful South. I was watching a documentary only the other night about um, Paul Heaton. The the man behind Beautiful South and the House Martins. He's a genius songwriter, national treasure in my book. Um, and that is Beautiful South, best of, great stuff. And Blackadder. Now these last three are all going to the same buyer, which is cool. Complete Blackadder, wonderful. The bookends. Now in the video where I was picking out stuff a couple of days ago, this was one of those items. Got it listed and it's sold quick. Let's pop that over there. Like that. So, bookends done. Miss Marple. Miss Marple. BBC audiobook. Very nice. Oh, it's starring June Whitfield. Didn't notice that before. Cool. Uh, where next? Miss Marvel. Arnold Schwarzenegger and then The Cure. So this Arnold Schwarzenegger is like a four film set. Oh, there it is. So it's got Predator, Terminator, Commando and Conan the Barbarian on. Sold that a number of times. And The Cure, Greatest Hits. What a wonderful album that is. So there we go, nice little selection. Let's bring these across. I'm not sure if any of these have little notes on to read, but we'll have a look. Ooh, oh, nearly, I <laughs> nearly lost it. Okay. Oh yes, we do have messages. Let's scroll back and check, nothing there. Um, Hi Nick and Andrea, my fiance and I are long time watchers of your channel. We have learned a lot about reselling from you. We both love Agatha Christie, so this CD will be perfect listening in the car. Keep up the great content from Amanda, Simon and Daisy the dog. Well, I'm sure Daisy the dog will enjoy a bit of Miss Marple. <laughs> Thank you so much, really appreciate that. I do love a bit of Agatha Christie. Oh, and there's a message on the um, Schwarzenegger that I just showed you. Hi Nick and Andrea, love the YouTube channel. Looking forward to watching Arnie as I'm a big fan. Well, you're gonna love that. Good stuff. 
Who was that? Joanne? Is there any more? No. Right. Next list. Okay. We are almost at the end. We have one, two, three, four, well, five to get, but two of them are the same thing. These um, Stabilo Easy Starts, two more packs going, but to different buyers. Job done. And then we sold Fantastic Beasts. Um, I had loads of Harry Potter bits in stock. I made up a complete set with Fantastic Beasts as one lot. And then I had a spare Fantastic Beasts, which I can't see. Uh, move some stuff it's got to be hiding in here somewhere oh it's right here it was there all along so that's that one another Adele so I listed four a couple of days ago three gone one left the best of the Jacksons double album and that will be it. I missed one. There was a little message on the Fantastic Beasts DVD as well from Sophie, uh, which says, Hi Nick and Andrea, love watching your videos. Had to pick this up. Thank you so much, Sophie. Enjoy the film. I've created a bit of a Leaning Tower of Pisa here. Selling fast plus these various assorted bits and bobs. So I'm gonna leave you there. At the moment, I've been fishing out sourcing videos from the channel where we go out and about finding all of the stuff you see in here. So please check this video out. Thank you so much for watching. Take care and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.